Good evening and welcome to our next episode of Cooking with Michael. And Candace. And Candace, we are back. Thank you all who watched last week. Hope you really liked that roast beef. Oh, so we good. We did. We loved it. <laughs> Freaking ate it. Tonight, another great dish. It can be done as an appetizer. It can be done as a main course. It can be done as something if uh, you're running late from work or you're running late from, you know, your side piece's house and you need to make... Or you just want a quick snack. Or you want a quick snack. I like the side piece. But anyway... Um, so we call it, it's buttered noodles, and you're thinking to yourself, well, that's freaking easy. Well, so is ice. We should get right. that. But a little bit of a trick to it. We'll show you that. Uh, but before we do that, as always, if you're in the Germantown, Maryland area, Montgomery County, you're looking for the best selection of beer, wine, girly drinks, and what have you, go to Fox Chapel Shopping Center, check out Chapel Beer and Wine, and ask Andrew. Um, tell him Mr. Mike or Ms. Candace. Ms. Candace sent you. He'll take great care of you, as always. He's been with us since the beginning. So thank you, Andrew. We are, uh, we're so glad you're along, and we're glad you're all along. So, let's show you how to do this. First, you want to take a pot of water and get it to boil. Then you want to get some egg noodles. Or really, any pasta will do, but we're using egg noodles because they cook fastest, and it's easiest for the shell. And then we're going to have, uh, basically, you take a stick of butter, cut it up into uh, slices, okay? A little bit of salt, a little bit of ground cayenne pepper, a little bit of garlic. Oh, Christ. Did I approve this? At a moderate amount. Parmesan cheese. Third cup of cheese. That's all. Not not a not a grain more. But anyway, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and boil. Uh, we're gonna basically follow the directions on the bag over the egg noodles. We're gonna boil. It takes about six eight minutes. Uh, so put them in there. When you're done, we'll show you the next step, which is really the last step, and uh, yeah. show you to make it all. There's so, really only two steps. Pretty much. So while you're doing that, uh, drink your beer or your girly drink. While your pasta's cooking, um, think about your side piece, and we'll talk to you when we're done. We're right back. All right. So it's done uh, cooking. The ice cubes are done too. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, real simple. We're gonna go ahead. And we're gonna just grab a big old bowl here, and we're just before we drained it. I'm just gonna go ahead and now this is where it gets fun. This is where it gets really difficult. This has this is where your skills as a chef will shine through. Take your butter, put it in there. Take your salt. A couple of twists. Take your garlic. A quarter of a teaspoon. Quarter of a teaspoon. Butter and garlic go really well together. The garlic enhances the butter flavor. Symphony, not a solo. It's been a long time since I've said that. Uh huh. Mm. All right, can take our just. No! That was fun. Okay, the purpose of using the cayenne pepper on these noodles is not to make them hot and spicy. If that's what you like, then that's fine. You can go do that. But um, the purpose is just to give just enough to like salt does, it brings out all of the other flavors. So, it's going to be like an eighth of a teaspoon for this entire bowl, okay? It's fun for me to watch her almost have a stroke, just so you know. Okay, so, can I reach, can I reach, can I reach? That is the tiny amount you will be using. After she's doing that, you take a third cup of Parmesan cheese. Try and get the better Parmesan cheese if you can. Um, just because it's it's healthier, it's better tasting, doesn't make you shit as much. And you won't have to use as much of it. Right, so we're just going to... Because it'll actually have flavor as opposed to the plastic. The crap that you get in the plastic bag. Yeah. Alright, so now that's all mixed up, or it's all in there, now what we're going to do is we're just going to mix it. Just keep stirring, just keep stirring. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. What do we do? We swim. What do you do? We stir. stir. And you stir it until the butter is completely melted. So we are all done mixing it up. And what we're going to do from here is we're going to scoop some out. Going off. He's just doing this to show off. Pretty much. People. So buttered noodles. It's just noodles, butter, a little cayenne pepper, some salt, uh, a little bit of garlic, and uh, some <laughs> cheese. Anyway, so let's, Yay, so let's see what it tastes like. Mm. Very good. Very good. So real simple. It's great comfort food. It is. It's great. That's really good. It's great for, um, it's great, again, great for a date night dinner. It's great for a date night snack. It's great for your own snack, a dinner by yourself, maybe for your kids too. Um, if you're running late from anything, it's really easy, real quick to make. Please make sure you try it, taste it, let us know what you think. Love it. As always, when you're watching the video, if you have not subscribed, please click the subscribe below. And of course, as always, please share with everyone you know, everyone you like, everyone you work with, all your friends' parents, all your friends' kids, 
Um, people you hate. People you hate. Your side piece, you've already talked about that, so share it with them as well. Um, I'm going to get my ass whooped into the show. But anyway, so just so you know, but again, uh, share with everyone, everyone you can. <laughs> so, as always, we'll see you next Saturday night, 8 p.m. I'm Cooking with Michael. And Candace. And Candace. Have a good night, everyone. Good night. Saturday, 8 p.m. I'm cooking with Michael. Or Candace. Or Candace? <laughs> Let's try this again. So.